Do prenatal diagnose CPAM always need surgery? I'm Cecilia Higena from Cincinnati Children's Hospital, and I think this is an article that you should know about. This is a retrospective study made in Stockholm, Sweden from 2002 to 2020. They aim to study if there was any prognostic factors in prenatal diagnosed CPAMs. And what did they find? They found 66 patients with prenatal diagnosed CPAMs. 56% were reduced during prenatal course. Only 31% of them needed surgery, meaning 69% were managed conservatively. After birth, only 19% developed symptoms. The risk factors for needing a surgery were mediastinal shift on postnatal imaging, high CVR, and large lesion size. So, it seems that not every prenatal diagnosed CPM needs surgery. Stay tuned for more articles that you should know about.